That police cruiser is out of service, sitting at an auto repair shop, most likely totaled after an accident this week while an officer was on duty in a construction zone. A distracted driver uh, rear ended the patrol car while it was sitting still there. The patrol car was there as an extra warning uh, with his blue lights on. Chief Al Tolbert says luckily no one was injured, but he's warning drivers to pay attention and reminding everyone of Alabama's move over law. There's a law in place that could prevent this, and it's, it not, not only does it cover law enforcement, it encompasses utility workers, tow truck drivers, you know, the phone company, whoever may be on the right of way. As for the cruiser, Chief Tolbert says the COVID-19 pandemic has made it tougher to purchase vehicles and find available parts. It's something departments have battled for months. We will be looking at, at a year to replace this vehicle if we have to do that. And, uh, you know, that, that puts a strain on our fleet. We have a small fleet of vehicles. While he prepares to face that obstacle, Chief Tolbert is sending a message to drivers as construction continues. Crews expected to be here on Highway 31 for the next couple of weeks. Be safe, be cautious, be respectful, and look out for the workers and law enforcement in the area. It's a dangerous environment out here for these guys and ladies that's working in these construction zones. It's also dangerous for uh, law enforcement working in these areas, stopping cars, or whether it's working an accident or assisting in these type situations. In Bay Manette, I'm Blake Brown, WKRG News 5.